The mother of a local father gunned down while riding a dirt bike says her pain is unbearable. Can't put that in words. It's too emotional. The first murder victim of 2020 was seen riding the bike on social media just minutes before the shooting. What did he do so bad that you had to stand up in a truck and shoot him 15 times? Tonight, his mother just wants to know why. There's no justice because he's not coming back. And she spoke only to Action News Jack's Ryan Nelson about what she's gone through since her son's death. Yeah, as Ryan shows us, the loss is still very fresh in her mind. 26-year-old Colin Felton's memorial at Cherokee Street grew a little bit bigger today. His mother, Katina Felton, left behind a teddy bear in his honor. Well, I come look for him. This is the last place I knew he was, so it's very emotional. Colin Felton was shot and killed here in January. He left behind a now four-month-old son. I'll be all right one moment, then the next moment I'm real angry because, like, People is just randomly killing like nobody lives matter. Nearby surveillance video captured the moment someone fired off at least 15 shots at her son from a black Dodge Ram. That was execution assault. Like you could have shot him one time and killed him, but you had to continuously shoot him. What did he do so bad? I want to know what he did so bad to you. Like I said, that you had to make that decision. After putting out a warning to be on the lookout for the Dodge Ram involved, JSO investigators later announced they were no longer looking for. Action News Jack showed you this exclusive video of a truck matching the description being towed away. We've asked JSO if the truck in this video is the same truck used in this murder. We're waiting for a response. Katina tells me she wants answers. I just want to know why. It will never be justice because I never get my son back. I don't care if they go to jail for the rest of their life. Hey, there's no justice can be done. Ryan Nelson, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jacks.